What's up guys, my name is Brandon and today I'll be showing you how to set any song as a ringtone or notification sound on your iOS device for free without a computer or a jailbreak. This works for any iPhone including the iPhone 7 and 7 Plus on any iOS version including iOS 10.2 and beyond. Before I go any further I do want to make it clear that you will need to have the music you want to create as a ringtone or notification sound saved in your music library. Now if you don't know how to do that, I did make a video for downloading music and importing that music into your music application but it was only for jailbreak devices so if you aren't jailbroken and you're on iOS 10 and above just simply go to Google on your computer type in the song name and artist followed by mp3 download the song or the album whatever you want import that to your iTunes library and sync your phone it's super simple I've pretty much been doing it my entire life all right so once you have some music in your music application you're gonna to want to go to the App Store on your device and go ahead and download the GarageBand application. It's free and if it shows up as $4.99, if it shows up as five bucks for you, you just need to go to your purchase section in the App Store and download it from there. Once you've downloaded and installed GarageBand, go ahead and open it up and once you get to this page right here, just go ahead and tap on Audio Recorder. From here, you're gonna tap on the Timeline icon up here in the top left, go ahead and tap on that. Now I want you to go ahead and tap on the Loop icon right up here up in the top right, go ahead and tap on that. Go over to the music section, tap on songs, then you're gonna scroll down and find the song you want to set as your ringtone or notification sound. And as you can see, some of these songs are actually grayed out. So if you have some grayed out songs, that just means that these songs are purchased, but they're not downloaded onto the device itself. So if you wanna download those, just go to your music application, find that song, and then you should see a download arrow in the bottom left in the music application. So if that doesn't work, you can always just go ahead to your computer, search Google for that song in MP3 format, download it, import it to your iTunes library and sync your device, and it should be in there. All right, so once we have the song that we want to set as our ringtone, go ahead and tap and hold on it. Then that will add it to the timeline. As you can see there, it imports and brings it into the timeline. You can just go ahead and scroll that over all the way to the very beginning. Now to get rid of that annoying ticking noise, just go ahead and tap on this metronome right here to disable the metronome. Once you have that disabled, you can go ahead and edit your song as you please. You can basically just trim it by bringing in the sides like that. And you can make it longer if you can tap this plus icon right here up in the top right. You can change it from 21 bars to however many bars you want. You can even set it as automatic. You can also add some effects. So you can see the FX button right there. You can add some effects right there. You can also change the EQ if you tap these settings right here. You can see you have some echo, some reverb. You can up the treble, the bass, compressor, all that good stuff. You can really, really edit this to your liking and you know just change it up to what you like. So once you have it edited to your liking, I'm gonna go ahead and start it right there. Drag it back over. As you can see, you can pretty much just pull out the whole song and just edit it to the pieces that you want to have in your ringtone. And once you have it done, once you have it edited to your liking, go ahead and tap on the little arrow icon up here in the top left. Tap on My Songs. It will save it right there. You're going to go ahead and tap on Select up in the top right. Tap on that. Once you have that selected, go ahead and tap on the little Share icon up in the top left. Scroll down and set it as ringtone. Now, if you get this message, you can adjust it if you want, or you can just go ahead and tap on continue and it will save it anyways. And you can name it whatever you want, my song, GGGY, whatever. Then go ahead and tap on export. And then straight from here, you can use the sound as, or you can just go ahead and tap on okay. And there you have it. You have saved a song as your ringtone or notification sound on your device without a computer. Now, obviously once you finish up in GarageBand, you can go ahead over to your settings application, go ahead to sounds, and haptics. Then you go down to ringtone and you can find your ringtone that you just created right there. And obviously if you click on the ringtone, you will hear it right there. Straight from the GarageBand application, straight from your music application. Very cool. You can set this obviously as your text tone, your ringtones and all that. If you go and scroll down to ringtones, it will show up for every single sound. So if you want it to be for airdrop, for example, you can go down and set it right there. So there you have it guys. That is just a simple way to set any song as a ringtone on your device without the need of a computer or a jailbreak. So hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to drop a like on this video. Make sure to subscribe for more useful iPhone tips, hacks, news, and much more. So thanks again for watching guys and I'll see you soon.